Lucas, have your performances gone, going, or going to be? My performances have gone. They've gone great. We uh, performed for all of August. That's why I was gone for all of August. I'm back now, because it's not August anymore. I did all the performances. Did 24 performances in a row. Or like, 24 performances in 24 days. And, and like a day off in the middle, I think. Um, so yeah, that's basically what happened there. Hello, you. You're clearly uh, supposed to be in disguise, huh? So yeah, went great. Five stars. Got an award. Got a poster. I mean, we we always had the poster. It's what we were basically handing out in leaflet form. Great fun. Okay, you got me. I give up. I regret my life choices. I will return the paint I stole. It's like they said, can't fight City Hall or City Plumbing. Come on, let's head back to that paint star thing. After you, I insist. Hmm. Oh, he just takes it. That's horrible. Well, okay. I always thought blue looked better on you anyway. So we'll go with it. Oh, that's cool. I appreciate that. Let's have a chat. So am I. Had a huge lunch rush today. I'm fresh out of everything. Let me lay off the snooze button a bit, eh? Hey, hey, big guy. What? You want my seat? Jesus Christ. Hello. What was that? I need a look on the air. It's gone. Oh no, it's Zoe. Hello, thank you for the host. Throw me off again. What is this? This is Paper Mario Color the Splash. Color the Splash? Color Splash. Um, the game's okay. Ish. Gameplay wise, mechanic wise, directorially. But writing wise, it's only made me chuckle a couple times. I only want my seat. Buzz off, plumber boy. Dude, that knife and fork on the sign fell off. Eh, uh, I don't want to think about it. Yeah, this coffee is really expensive, but at least it's drinkable. Mm. Ow, I put my mouth on the coffee. <laughs> and you're all on your own. Wanna chat? I got nervous having so many people in line behind me, so I just ordered the first thing on the menu. You can, you can go get something else, dude. Unless you're like me and that you're scared of the actual cashiers. Literally, today, the computer was dead this morning. Had to get Windows 10 so that it turned on. I also needed it so my new capture device works. And uh, I got my housemate to do it. He was already offered to do it, but I was like, I could join him and, you know, have him, like, how I can explain to the cashier the problems with my computer and get Windows 10 that I needed. I just sat at home, watched YouTube, ate chocolate until, hey, he came back and he's got the update. And now we're playing games, live streaming, and everything works. That's how it goes. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, he's actually doing it. It's not a trick. Yeah, good as new. Also, I'm surprised the bucket actually lost colour. Am I free to go? Or is this the end of the road? <laughs> Aha! It's this part of the trailer. I know this. <coughs> is this my my thumbnail? Who knows? But at least it's all visible on stream. Toad, get out of there! <laughs> okay, I guess he can't. So how am I supposed to dodge this? How am I supposed to know where it is? Uh, wait, what? Am I missing something? I might be. Maybe there was a shadow cue or something. Toad's upside down! Oh no, he's good. I like it. They've all got actual personalities. I get what they're doing. They rode up my ruddy, they rode up ready road. My cafe is sky high. What am I supposed to do now? Someone probably already owns the trademark for sky high cafe. Can't you, I don't know, unroll the ground somehow, Mario? Sure. <laughs> also, nice foreshadowing with this knife. I appreciate that. Right, I will take these first. I can't get to the tape on the other side. Looks like I stuck to the ground somehow. There's no use hitting it from this side. <coughs> okay. Um, I will hammer things because I don't think I can get up on that path. Maybe I can. I don't know. I'll try some things out. That just looks like... It doesn't quite look right. There's way too much gap between the foreground and the background. Like, there should be, like, something in between. Maybe? Maybe that's their way of getting away with it. I don't know. Right, something here. Oh, I know how. I see it. The tree comes open. Aha! I'm a genius. Hello, shy guy. Bye, shy guy. This isn't actually that bad level design. I quite enjoyed that. 
because actually stuff was happening. And I guess that's going to be the gimmick for all these levels. Right, Toad, you ready to go? No, no, he's not. Okay. Is this going to happen on every path? Could they really not, like, plot it that well? There we go. Let's crush some other shy guys, shall we? <laughs> now I'm messing with my cafe and gets away with it! They're dead. And they're about to become even more red than they were before. The toad signs upside down. I like it. Oh my, good timing! These mask guys must have tipped well, but it may have tipped well, but I can't forget them after we did the cafe. I'm trying to teach them a lesson, but I've been doing Pilates. So I'm not here enough to squash him. But I was thinking if we jump at the same time, we can give him a real stomping. Come on, please. I know you're a murderer on the inside. Let's go. I can't forgive these guys, Mr. Regular Shop. If we jump at the same time, we'll give him a real stomping. That is a lot of damage. The customer is not always right. Oh, I feel so much better. Back to the cafe with me. Thanks, Mario. My phone just randomly rumbled. It didn't get a notification. Oh well. Whew. Yeah, I could get behind this game actually if I go with it at that kind of pace, just kind of speed through and avoid the pointless fights. I'll be quite alright with that. This seems like a game that what? How long would this game take? Ten hours? That's, nah, that can't be right. I mean, it's two and a half streams. I don't believe that. Hmm. Hmm. -mm. Each level's probably 15 minutes, and there's like eight worlds, I imagine. Whoa, look at that. Clowns. You ever seen those? You in the middle of summer or something? That joke made no sense. I gave up on it halfway through. Also, all I saw was a fish. But I have no oh, it was a toad. Okay, good. Oh, yeah, I see it in the... Wow, how did I... I only saw it when it was doing that, and it just looked like a floppy fish. Excuse me. Must have fallen somewhere in this lake. Hope he's okay. We should go look for him. Cool. Okay. Shall do. Do you not care about the stars? I guess both is the point. <sighs> Luigi's Mansion 2 mode? There's something stuck to the other side. I don't think we can open it from here. We really need to get in there. We can just get on top of those blocks, but you'll be able to drop to the other side. Wait a minute, yes, there's a clean line. Alright, Mario, I'm going to teach you a mind-blowing technique. Watch closely. V viewers probably won't even be able to watch this on the thing. There, see this line on the gate? Looks like stairs, right? When you see clear lines like this in the world, you can use the cutout technique. Go ahead, press Y. I think it only works on the gamepad. We'll find out. Bam! That dotted line right there? That's what I'm talking about. We can use this power to transcend dimensions and cut out that part of the background. Get cutting, Mario. Don't worry, I come with a razor. Or something. Oh, scissors. That would make more sense. We've stepped out of our dimension. How's my lid feel? Comfy? Okay. You can't see this, so I guess I'll just put it in here so you can see what's going on slightly. No, because I'm not the screen. There you are. Magic. That's about as good as I can do. Sorry. Okay, now start from the bright shining point and trace along the dotted lines to cut it out. Of course, I'm seeing how it looks over there. Yeah, it looks somewhat okay. Um, am I using this? I'm using my hands. Okay. You cannot see anything close to what's going on. But oh well. Oh, am I supposed to tap? No, I'm not. I'm supposed to drag. It's a, it's a bad old gamepad. I can't even see what if you can see what I'm doing. There we are. That way. That way. All right. No, there you are. God, this is this. This doesn't make any sense. That's some quality cottage. 
Wow, that's amazing. It, it peeled right off. You can't even see it. The exposure's too high. This flag is the goal. You know what to do with it. Okay. Well, wow, it's, it's a whole staircase. He jumped on the flag. Who, who put this? Why is the flag there? Who built a flag? There we go. Right, we're back to gameplay now. Also, I saw a hello. Hello, Super Saptile. Welcome. Thank you for joining us for Paper Mario Color Splash. The game's okay, is basically the answer. That's what you want to know with the title. You're free to go now. Unless you want to join us on the actual adventure, as I'd learn that I have to keep playing this thing and that my gamepad touchpad doesn't work very well. You did it. It's a cutout technique. When you see other places where it seems like it. Yeah, alright. You see dotted lines a bit. Yep. Yeah. Alright, let's drop down to the other side of the gate. Look at the fallen toad. So we just stood on it. Okay. It didn't actually remove it. Okay. Now I know. Oh, I know this song. That's weird. Like, it's, it is weird when I get the soundtrack first. Like, I recognize the songs before I actually know. Yes. No. I think it's a different remix version of what I know. You got you are so in the way I couldn't avoid you. Actually, that's okay with me. If there's fights that I can't avoid, then it means I will actually be able to power up. So I appreciate that. I don't appreciate that we've got the exact same move set as Sticker Star. Like I'm recognizing some of these cards as the stickers that were in the earlier thing. And I do actually have Sticker Star, so maybe for like April Fools. Maybe I'll do a Sticker Star marathon. I think I've been wanting to do that for like two years now, but never really wanted to actually put myself through that suffering. I came up with the idea while I was picking, playing Pokemon Black and I thought that was enough torture for me, so. I got the Red Shy Guy! Oh, great! What do I do with him now? Chuck him in the bin? What's the... I guess he's like a partner? There aren't any partners in this game, I forgot about that. <laughs> you wouldn't even play Sticker Star ironically? I agree, Poke Sprouts. I think that's why I started stopping. And also people... I started stopping? That's a weird sentence. Plus, I don't know how many people would actually watch it. Maybe if I did like an eight-hour marathon and plugged the whole thing on YouTube, maybe then people would watch it. I don't know. I don't know. What's your problem, bub? You want to stick up with us? Ooh, I bet you think you're so cool being a single shy guy. We we're only rolling four deep. So we need one more to be a five stack, yo. Enough talk. Stack him, boys. Cripes, he ran away. Hey, check out the ratty moustache on this one stack over here. Ha! <laughs> huh, looks like the upper lip has found a tanuki suit. Stack this clown! Alright then. Oh wow, I'm surprised that worked. I just mashed A. Right, let's use the Hop Slipper. That's not even a fun name. Not really. Where's the spring bit? Like, why is it called a hop? You can hop once. Why doesn't it understand the concept of spring? Spripper or something. Spring slipper. Spring lipper. I don't know. Hop slipper. Ah, oh, man. Whatever. Also, if I sound like I've got a Scottish accent, which I'm pretty sure I don't, but that would also explain be explained by the fact that I was in Edinburgh for a month. But I was surrounded by a bunch of English people, so... Probably not. But I didn't think of that at one point. I was like, maybe I'll come back to streaming with a, not a Scottish accent. But I don't think I did. If people even know what a Scottish accent is. Or is it all a British accent to you people? I've already had this rant about British accents, so never mind. And English accents. Same thing. Wow, this is the kind of gameplay I can get behind. That's horrifying. Aww. Dun dun. I'm not supposed to be the end of this stuff, but thanks for scrapping those guys. Why are we looking out? Why are we soggy than we started then? I said the one guy can't make a difference. But I, but I should just be a cog in the machine. Oh, I would think me. I'm living my life as a single layer of shy guy awesome now. You know, for a shy guy, you're all right, kid. No, oh, dog and pink. It's a neon card. Whoa, whoa, what a oh, whoa, whoa, what a gift! Your card slots increased. You can now play an additional card during your turn in battle. In other words, you can play two cards per turn now. Thanks, shy guy. Wait, where'd he go? Let's come stand with us. It'll be fun. Like, tr 
No, maybe it's already trend. Not just fun. Studies show that stacking in groups of five can increase HP and lower cholesterol. So why don't you? Well, maybe this is where they're about to go for it. Oh look, two shanko stacks, four, four stacks right on cue. Let's experiment with that second card slot. Set two cards at once and unleash mayhem, Mario. Why don't they become an eight stack? It's only they spent as much time on the battle system as they did on po dialogue. They did. They. D Boy, I love haggis. Oh yes, that is a Scottish egg. There was haggis everywhere in Edinburgh. Every shop you could order anything, anything with haggis. They basically had ice cream with haggis on the side. It was weird. Join us. Join up with us. It'll be fun. No, thank you. Okay. Here. How about a, a red shy guy? And then I'll, I'll just. Well, I only need two. I don't. Okay, I'll go with three. Where's my three step? There it is. Go, shy guy. Flip them both. Don't flip them. That's cool. I appreciate that we actually do have like a partner system now. I'm sure he disappears after this fight, but I like that he flips, he switches out. Slightly nostalgic, but not perfect. There you go, shy guy. Any chance you join us? Probably not. See, I, I skipped a bunch of battles and I'm still good on max max paint. I'm happy with that. Coolio, let's go. Hello, shy guy. Please tell me you're the soggy one. No, you're a toad. You are just shoes. Okay. You got toe shoes. Or high eyes. Be back in a bit. Alrighty, Streven. See you in a mo. I can't get that question mark block, and I probably don't care anyway, so goodbye, Cooper. Uh, ugh, that one's a better Cooper. He actually managed to snuck up on me. Okay. Wow, these guys do a lot of damage. And I did hear about, yes, the music when you're low on health is pretty cool. I like it. Great for parties, truly. Are there badges in this? There's probably not, is there? I'd quite like one where it's like when you're low on health, because then I, I won't even put the effort of getting mushrooms. But probably not. There we go, I'm ready with just the one. <clears throat> Thank you to all of our Patreon supporters. I've been meaning to reshuffle a lot of my Patreon to be the best for you guys, so if you have any suggestions of what you'd like to see, do please let me know. As for now, Thank you to The Shepherd246, Dylan Brill, Red5 Rainbow, Dazzle Kitty, and Melka Velasco for the support. We're only a small band of people now, but your support has helped so much. And if anyone else is willing to help, then please click on the on screen link now. Anything will help. Thank you so much.